Hello, hello, hello. And today we are going to be making quick and easy patriotic dessert, perfect for a dinner party, perfect for a holiday barbecue, easy peasy. So we are going to make little strawberry blueberry tarts and we're going to make them individual size just like this. So perfect for a picnic, barbecue, dinner party. These will work and they're so easy. So I thought I am ma making them. So let's make them together. I have already diced small some strawberries and some blueberries because that's what I had. Of course, you could use blackberries, raspberries, whatever you have. And I'm going to toss these with about a tablespoon or so of just some cornstarch. You can use arrowroot starch too, um, whatever you have, just to toss them so that they absorb some of the liquid these will throw off. So I'm just going to toss these a little bit in a little cornstarch. And then I will show you what I did here to prep these. I took my pie crust that I bought at Trader Joe's and rolled it out a little bit. So you ended up with this. I rolled it. It was a little broken and I just rolled it and it came right back together. No, no drama. And then used a biscuit cutter here that I have. It's actually this whole set of biscuit cutters was a gift from a viewer. Thank you very much. And just cut it out like this. And boom. Easy. Goes right to, to the tin. Perfect fit. And we have here our tin with all our little pies ready to go. So how cute is that? I know. So cute. So I will whoops, make room here and we're going to fill these. Oh, I got to get out my caps. Hold on a second. My caps. I'm going to try and have this go as quick as possible. I already cut a few things to put on top. So I am going to start with a little jam and I am using strawberry, but you can use strawberry, blueberry, whatever you want. And I'm just going to put a little bit of jam into the bottom of each little pie here. Try not to make a total, a total mess here. <laughs> but I see so many, I'm always trying to find a cute thing to make for a patriotic dessert or party that is not the cake. You know, everyone makes that cake that has the flag on it. Um, my mom's birthday was 4th of, Ju 4th of July, so we always were having 4th of July get-togethers and parties and trying to come up with patriotic things. So I thought this was really cute and really easy because really in about 10 or 15 minutes you have an impressive dessert. So there we go. We've got jam in the bottom of all these. Oh my gosh, it's going to be so good. And I'm just going to put my berries in. And these are going to be delish. Let me go quick here. These would be great to take if you need to take something for a school snack. Of course, they still let you bring a school snack because the kids would love these because they're little individual size. Now, you could also take this pie crust and just make a pie. <laughs> Put the pie crust in a pie tin and you are good to go. Okay, see how easy this is. It only took me a couple of minutes to dice the strawberries. I'm going to fill them a little bit full because you know the strawberries will cook down quite a bit. Plus I chopped them, so let's use them. What is your favorite red, white, and blue dessert? Seems so... Many. We have so many yummy fruit stands around here that it is summer season. It is time. You know what? I'm going to cut one more here because I can make one more. Oh, nope. Not quite enough. So I'll just keep going and overfill these. <laughs> but they should be yummy. I will post a picture when these are done so you can see too how cute these turn out. So once they're done, and they're cooled, I will sprinkle them with some powdered sugar on top just for a little cuteness when I'm serving them. So these, there we go. We used all our berries. Everybody got plenty of berries. So now I have made some toppers. Now, if you're making these for a patriotic holiday, like 4th of July or Memorial Day, you could use little stars. I don't have a star cookie cutter. I just have a round one. So I made little tops. So like two crust pies I'm going to make here. These cute. 
And I also, I cut some strips because if you wanted to make like stars and stripes, you could do, here's some stripes. Put some of these. You could also do a lattice if you wanted, but I thought I'd try that. Stripes. And then I, if I had a cookie cutter for a star, you could make this in a star. And you'd have stars and stripes. Isn't that cute? I know. I thought this was so cute and yummy because everybody loves a fruit tart. And this just gives you a little bite of yumminess. Oh my gosh. How cute are these? And I have this, I tried to make a little flower. Maybe we'll stick him on our, on our stripes. And so that is that cute and easy, easy peasy fruit tarts. And I'm going to take the egg wash. This is just an egg that has been beaten a little bit. So we get a nice golden brown crispy crust. And so just put a little egg wash on these and we are good to go. If you had a little sanding sugar in red, you could probably put a little bit of that on there if you want to get super decorative. And there we go. Easy peasy, individual, quick and easy fruit tarts. Enjoy.